right guys, you are on the end unit, so you have this stairwell right here, you have all this kind of like private walkway, and this gives you a view of that, that scared me, <laughs> so we're going to walk in, love the engineer hardwood floors, you heard all that noise outside, once you shut this door, like you can barely even hear the plane that was just going above us so it's well insulated so right to the right we're going to go in this room first this is the bunk room i'm going to zoom out so right now they have a twin over full you can definitely do a full over full to maximize the heads and beds this is where your ac handler is so when that turns on you can hear it from inside this room. So I'm gonna go this way. Such a cute piece right there. This is the one that has the nice, good size walk-in closet. Tall ceilings throughout. And as I'm kind of walking back through the condo, I'll kind of shift my camera up so you guys can see the ceilings as well, but nothing that I saw. Cute furniture, cute light beachy furniture. You can see the golf from this window. And this is just a traditional closet, but still somewhat of a walk-in, still a great size. Kind of give you a view of the room from this side. All right. right across the hall is going to be your guest bathroom for these two bedrooms. Granite countertops traditional cabinets, tile floor, single vanity, traditional fiberglass tub shower combo. Okay, all right, show you these two closets real quick. Water heater closet, but also it could be used for great storage if you want to make this an owner's closet, this side because it is all open to the laundry room, which this would have to be accessible. But laundry closet with a stackable washer dryer. Love this entry table and decor here. Galley style kitchen, tray ceiling, stainless steel appliances, granite countertops, dark traditional cabinets. You do have a pantry here, so a good sized pantry. Cool. This is gonna give you a view from this angle of the living room, dining room, and kitchen. I love how they've maximized this space. This is a great size table that fits six, and then you've got four bar stools, so it can eat a total of 10. Love the colors of the paints, the decor. We can see if this is a sleeper sofa. We forgot to check that while we're on the phone. It's not a sleeper sofa. Okay. We'll go to the master. Great size master, king size bed with nightstands on both sides. 
great big size dresser. Again, you can see the gulf from this window as well. You can even see the dark blue into the emerald green colors of the water through your window. We'll go into the master bath, same granite countertops, dark cabinets, double vanity. You've got your nice soaper tub right here. Love this piece over the tub. Your walk-in shower is tiled from ceiling to floor. And you have this nice little sitting area. And then toilet room. All right, and then here is the master closet. It's a decent size master. All right, now we're gonna come out here to the patio. Now I'm gonna be really quiet so you can hear what it hears like in here and then what it would sound like out there. But when I get close to those windows right there, I'm gonna zoom in and show you guys that you can see the water from in here as well. Okay, onto the patio. So you're right here at the entrance, that's the gate, that's the beach access, but then you do have another beach access down there as well. This is Scenic 98. This sidewalk runs all the way east to west on Scenic 98, so you never have to get on the road if you just wanted to bike or walk. You can have golf carts on Scenic 98. There's several restaurants, bars, shops, entertainment along this road. You can see the golf down there too. Let's see if I can zoom in. See the pretty water. All right. Now we're gonna walk back in and I'm just gonna kind of focus on the ceilings for you guys. look above everything that had water on the above unit because you do have the fourth floor above you nothing above the toilets the sinks the tubs the showers you turn on this light everything looks good up there this is going to be the exact same layout upstairs these ceilings up here let's check the ceiling above their washer and dryer room nope nothing up there looks good that is a rough spot but it's not a wet spot it just looks like the popcorn texture of the ceiling is different because it definitely doesn't look like any water stains or anything. So, nothing in this room. 
Sorry if I'm making you guys dizzy. And nothing in this room. All right, there you have it.